the CBS2 Broadcast Center. This is CBS2 News right now. Only on two, she could barely breathe because of COVID-19. I'm amazed that I'm alive. How a Chicago woman recovered in only three days. Only on two, she thought she was going to die, but the luck of the draw may have saved a Chicago woman's life. CBS 2 Susan Lemonyo talked to the COVID-19 survivor about what helped her heal in just a few days, Suzanne. Well, Jim, she was randomly selected to take part in a clinical trial using remdesivir. Well, she believes that drug and a higher power saved her life. Tabina Khan took her temperature three times two weeks ago. I was in denial and disbelief. I thought my thermometers are broken. I probably need new batteries. There's no way I could have had a fever of 105. So you called your father's physician in Florida? I called my father's physician, Dr. Jamie Ben Simon, who took care of my father uh, for 40 years. And he said to me, Tabina, you need to go to the emergency room. She went to the Northwestern ER. She tested positive for COVID-19 and had a dangerously low oxygen level of 77%. They took me immediately to intensive care unit and they wanted to intubate me and put me on a ventilator. And I told them that I did not want that. Khan lost her father, Edward Khan, on Valentine's Day this year. She feels he was watching over her. When I was in intensive care unit, that my father came to me in a vision and told me that it was not my time to go. I was selected, randomly selected. I believe my father in heaven saw to it that I, I got this drug because I wouldn't be talking to you or I wouldn't be alive unless I had it. Hospital records show Khan took remdesivir for five days. I was able to breathe after I received it. And you couldn't breathe before you had been given the remdesivir? Oh, no, I could barely breathe. After 12 days at Northwestern, three of them in the COVID-19 ICU, she's home after taking remdesivir, which is in short supply. I want all the hospitals around the country to see to it that they can get more of this. I want the government, would be nice if they could reach out to Gilead, who produces this medicine, to see if they can get more of it. It saved my life.